Hey, what's up, guys? It's X Jaws, and um, I'm going to be posting a setup video as soon as possible. Just want to let you guys know that. Uh, but more importantly, right here, this commentary, uh, this isn't me. This is actually a really cool guy from Scotland, XBRZZ. Uh, go ahead, introduce yourself. Well, my name is Jordan, and I'm from Scotland, and I'm 15 years old. And, and my PSN is XBRZZ, and I post video games like X Jaws. So. There yeah, go. that's um, <laughs> pretty much it. Um, I messaged him and asked him if he wanted to do a dual commentary. I thought he was really cool. And uh, at first, we were kind of confused how we were going to do this uh, because he has PlayStation and I have Xbox, and neither of us have the opposite console. Yeah. <laughs> but we decided to do it on uh, Skype. So it, it works out. If you know what Skype is, it's like an online phone call. Um, so, yeah, that's how we're doing the dual commentary. Uh, do you want to talk about the gameplay for a minute? What you're using here? Um, I'm using the Tar 21, and I'm using Scavenger Pro, Stop and Power Pro, and Stadium Pro, and I'm using the kill streak setup of seven for Harriers, eight for Emergency Airdrop, which is pretty good. Emergency Airdrop, and I'm using eleven for Chopper Gunner, I think. But this is quite an old yeah. game because um, on my last Prestige now, because I've done the hack and. This is when I'm on my <laughs> first prestige, I think. <laughs> uh, uh, well, you know, I, I don't really mind if people hack. I'm just going to talk about it for a second. I don't mind if people hack at all. It really doesn't bother me. Yeah. Because at the end of the day, I mean, it's just a video if you're game. level 10... <laughs> yeah, if you're 10... Yeah, at the end of the, ga the day, it's just a video game. But also, if you're 10th prestige level 70, and I'm first prestige level 70, it really doesn't matter to me. I mean, I, I've never used five classes in one game, and that's why I don't really see the point in prestiging. Um, just because I... Th my biggest problem is I cannot get to level 35 to get Ninja Pro for my life. Because yeah. I just... I hate hearing my footsteps. Uh, do you have a headset? No, I've not got a headset, so I don't really bother about hearing my footsteps or that. But... Uh, Oh man, I mean, it's like I think some other commentators have talked uh, talked about it, but once you get a headset, it's like just because other people don't have headsets, you know that they can't hear you. But if you have to hear your own footsteps, it just drives me crazy. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> that's just me. But anyway, uh, you're using the Tar Twenty One, and I know you already said that, but um, for me, the Tar Twenty One is a good gun, but it's kind of hard for me to use it for long range situations like all the other assault rifles, and I almost have to treat it like a you know, a submachine gun. I kind of rush with yeah. it more. I don't really like play defense. Have you ever used silencer with it? Yeah. See, yeah. that's the thing. You can that's use the red dot or the mar the Mars sight. Yeah. <laughs> that's um, what I use the most. And those work for it, long range. This is like me just unlocked it, so I was just trying to get silencer for mm -hmm. it. So I oh, usually yeah. use silencer. Yeah, with I could. That. It seems like you. <laughs> I am sorry. We keep interrupting no, okay, each other. Okay. <laughs> uh, yeah. But uh, yeah, I could tell that there was a lot of muzzle flash, and you didn't have the silencer at first, and I was like, uh, what is he using here? Is he using FMJ? Yeah, uh, see, there's yeah, a challenge Yeah, you uh, prestige. Yeah. And the thing about the emergency airdrop, I would just wanted to talk about that, is just because, like, I've tried to use that thing, um, and at first I thought I could use it to get a nuke, and then I figured out I couldn't um, in the beginning of the game. Yeah. But I think the emergency airdrop is so random that it's... I mean, it could be a good kill streak, but it's not. But I really haven't pegged it as whether or not I like it or not. I've used it and had good results. I've used it and had terrible results. And I don't really like that, going into a game and kind of the game deciding whether or not I do good and not me. Yeah, because it's kind of luck at the end of the day. Because if you get, like, an AC-130, a chopper gun, and Harriers, your team's obviously going to win the game. But if you just get hot with sentry guns and UAVs, it's not as helpful, is it? Yeah, it... Yeah, I mean, I don't know, because I don't use it that much. I don't know if you do, no. do you? Well, I, what I'm curious is, is there the same rate of chopper gunners as there is UAVs? Because, I mean, from I don't think it's that much different, if it is different at all. Um, just because there are so many low kill streaks that aren't good, that they would have to kind of even it yeah. out. But at the end of the day, it doesn't... There's two things that are bad about it. It's unpredictable and it doesn't add to your kill streak. So I would not recommend it to anybody uh, Just trying to go for who watches nuke. my videos. <laughs> There's no point in using it, really. <laughs> yeah, it, I wouldn't rec Yeah, definitely no point in using it there. But overall, as a kill streak, uh, I just don't like it just because it's unpredictable and doesn't count as your kill streak. Have you ever used uh, Zip oh. Pro? The, no, I haven't used Sid Rep at all. Um, and I, want, I was thinking about doing it, yeah. and I heard somebody else talking about in their commentaries that 
they want to get sit rep pro but it's so hard because nobody uses c4 or claymores yeah and it's like c sit rep pro is it not meant to be like ninja like kind of thing because it makes other yeah. people's footsteps louder so if you had a headset you'd yeah. be able to hear them from like further away and stuff like that mm -hmm. see that's the thing i think infinity war got really un was really uncreative uh for one um that the sit rep pro is basically ninja uh pro yeah. in a way like not exactly the same but in a way it's the same and also after like all those like um announcements that they were taking out things like juggernaut martyrdom and last stand and making them into death streaks and then they have last stand in the game i don't think it's that annoying but i just think they added it in there just to have you know another like all of them to be even amounts of perks do you know what happens when you have last stand and final stand on because I don't, I'm just wondering if anyone no. knows. <laughs> what do you mean? What, what like, do you mean, what happens? If, if you go into last stand, that's kind of you going into last stand as well, if you know what I mean. So what What would happen? Oh, alright. Last... What is no, the you difference? Know how you can use both of them at the same time. Oh, so what would happen? oh I see what you're saying. Would it just be a big... I, that is really... That's a good question. Hold on. Um, I don't know. Well, I'll have to test that. I can. Uh, well, I don't know what would happen. I really don't. That's kind of weird. So what happens, subscribers? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, guys. Does anybody? Does anybody here? If you leave a comment, if you know what would happen, if you had last stand and final stand, would it just go straight to final stand? Like, would you get to get back up or not? Because that that's actually a really Maybe good question. Just Never thought on last stand. Um, <laughs> Maybe just on last stand. <laughs> yeah. Maybe that's how you get God mode. Um, so, I'm trying to think, uh, right here in the game, you play, your bullets look so much different than mine, and a lot of people will ask me why my bullets are weird, and that's just because, um, <laughs> I have a shitty TV, and I'm gonna show it in my setup video today, or tomorrow, I don't know when I'll upload it, um, but, the thing is, guys, and I, I don't mean to advertise on your video, I'm sorry uh, about this, but this is gonna be my video for today, um, if, if my toolbar gets 500 downloads, I'm going to do an open lobby for everybody. And I want to ask BRZZ, do you, have you ever done I an open lobby actually, or are you considering doing one? It's a bit one? harder on PS3 because on Xbox, what do you do to have an open lobby? Does just people go on your like name and then click well, join session or something like that? Well, you send a private chat invite. Um, you guys, on PlayStation yeah. Network, you guys have private chat, right? And then do you have parties where you can have more so. than two people but in them? So. Alright, well, on um, Xbox Live, when you send a private chat invite, you can actually view their profile right from there after you send the request. And then you can join their session without ever sending a friend request. And I can set my uh, Xbox so that nothing pops up on my screen if anybody comes online or anybody messages me or anything like that. That yeah. way I don't get spammed with uh, chat invites but and all the people can join the game. On and PlayStation, join session is I mean, like a new know. thing. Because in Call of Duty 4, we never had join session. Yeah, we just had like to invite somebody. Are you serious? It was under barracks and you go to party invite and you can just invite them from there and it doesn't come up the top right it comes up on their actual screen playing Call of Duty so it's, it's different yeah so we're new to join that's session that's crazy I never knew that, that. So. well no well, you, sometimes do you like, uh, I get really annoyed session? with do you like that? My, like, I sometimes join my games and that Uh, I get here's what I get. I don't know if you've ever gotten this, but like for me, the game isn't barely any fun anymore unless I make it fun. Like I, I like to use like the worst guns yeah. of the game. I like to <laughs> run around, you know, with an MP5K with an ACOG on it, whatever I have to do. And the other day, I was using a Barrett 50 Cal <laughs> with an ACOG, and I was no scoping like an idiot. I was having some fun. And I was going like one in six, and this guy joined my game, and he's like, "Wow, you're not oh even any God. good anymore. You suck. I'm unsubscribing." And he was like with like three of his friends, and like people think like I'm literally supposed to try every single game, and I'd say like maybe ten percent of my games yeah, I'm going for a at The moment I was you trying find for the game boring, and like you have to kind of do other stuff. Only to using make it knife, as in I'm only using the kill streak tactical nook, and that's quite challenging. <laughs> oh. 
Wow. I'm at yeah, my that is kill extremely so challenging. I think I got like a six kill streak so trying to do that. I'm yeah. not joking. And I'm, I'm. No way. Are you kidding me? That is crazy. Yeah. Anyway, guys, that's the whole game. Um, sorry we didn't really talk about the uh, gameplay, but I'm going to leave a link to XBRZZ's channel in the description. Please go check him out. Please download my toolbar and anything else you want to say. Download his toolbar. <laughs> nah, all right. Um, I'll see you later, guys, and uh, peace.